Hi guys, we've got a new shave with another new product to me. Stick around, I'll be right back. Hi guys, welcome to another shave and scent of the day. Um, today we are doing Barbas. Um, we're using this soap and I've got the matching splash here. Um, what else do I have? I have my <clears throat> custom brush from Ryan Tansy, Turnings by Tansy, um, and the knot is a hand tied from Frank at Strike Gold Shave. Um, weapon of the day is my carbon with a Voshkod blade in there. Um, and then my scent of the day will be John Varvatos Artisan Pure. I have a bad back. Um, I hurt my back last week. Um, I was mowing and getting the, um, just kind of cleaning the yard up and everything. And over the winter time, my rock wall uh, to my driveway got knocked down. So I was moving a lot of really big, heavy stones um, <clears throat> and it initially hurt. And then I thought I got better. Um, and then by Monday afternoon, this is, this is now Sunday, by Monday afternoon, I couldn't walk upright. Um, and I haven't been upright since then until today. Yesterday, I did a bunch of stretching um, and I've had muscle relaxers, which really didn't do anything for it whatsoever. It's just make me sleep and the uh, muscles are still stuck. Anyway, this is a really long story, but, um, anyway, um, I'm, I'm upright right now and I don't know how long that's going to last. Um, I did stretch again before this and take a hot shower. So, uh, I'm going to get right into this and hopefully we'll be able to get through this before my back locks up again. So, uh, really long story there, uh, that I'm sure you guys really care a lot about. <laughs> So here we go. First try. Obviously, have never used this before. Off the puck, it's a nice, nice soapy kind of barbershop. I feel like I detect a little rosemary, uh, some citrus in there. Nice clean scent. So, so far, so good. Um, I do have my extremely bougie spa, riding, spa water ready to go as well. Um, so let's just go ahead and get into this. Um, not going to talk <coughs> too much today. Um, I'm probably going to have to kind of hurry this up. That doesn't mean I'm not going to test the soap. doesn't mean that I'm not going to get a good shave, but I just need to do a little more shaving, a little less talking, which may be tough for me. Nice creamy top, uh, fairly firm soap. Um, I wouldn't call it a soft soap. I wouldn't call it a hard puck either. It's just kind of somewhere in between. All right, so we'll load this up nicely. This is a glycerin-based soap. Or a heavy glycerin soap, I guess you'd call it. I mean, it's a lye-based soap, like all soaps. All right, so I've got a bunch there, um, and we can go back to the puck if we need to. Once again, I don't really know what to expect from this because I haven't used it, but Big Dude Barbus, we'll see if I can pronounce his name right. Uh, I'm going to say it's Balukas Gruhoski. Um, that's what I'm going with, and I hope I didn't butcher that too much. Uh, but Big Dude Barbus, um, you'll see him comment on my videos all the time, and I promised him once I got off of my spending freeze um, that I would buy some Barbus and try it out. He's been excited for me to try it and really wanted me to try it for a while so i did make a purchase and unfortunately i didn't realize that he has a store also um and so i could have bought it retail from him um and i would have just to you know just to patronize him as he's been you know <clears throat> really nice and supportive of me um but i ended up buying it from the razor company along with some other things um, anyway, it seems like a super nice guy and <clears throat> hopefully I'm going to like his soap and splash, but we shall see. No matter how nice you are to me, I still won't sugarcoat it. I'll give you the real, I promise you. Kind of fluffy feeling so far. We'll see what kind of water it can take. A 
in any soap that you have if it breaks add a little more product from the tub and you can get it right back but i don't think we're going to have that problem this looks like this is going to be a higher structured lather from the start which is totally fine nice clean smell Nice, clean barbershop. Nice and fluffy, as you can see. Like that big lather. Mm. Back is already starting to tighten up a little bit, but hopefully we can get through this okay. As long as it doesn't start spasming, I'll keep going. If we spasm, I'm out. I don't care if I only shave half my face. Once the spasms start, you're in trouble. Very fluffy lather. Whoop, whoop, I'm losing it. Look, we got a lot of water in there. A lot, look at that. It's sliding off my face. All right, so I'm going to say we are good here. Some good shine. Really pretty. Got a lot of water in there. A little in the mouth. Um, Not bad at all. So not real, not real bitter kind of a a clean flavor um that's pretty good i would give that a a five even on the tasteometer i know that's crazy nice job on the flavor <laughs> i know you formulated that just for me to eat it all right here we go carbon plus plus plate voshkod and a bunch of days growth I'm not even sure how many at this point. Hmm. Nice slickness. Very good. This is a pretty economical soap and splash as well. I think it's like 25 28 bucks something like that for soap and splash so that's pretty good i think my latest uh gentleman's nod soap was was 28 by itself or 27 something like that so that, that'll just give you an idea of where we are price wise yeah nice slickness good Doing a great job. Yeah, very good. I was watching Tennessee women's softball. Well, not like there's a men's softball, but there could be. Um, and Arkansas hit a blast on Tennessee early and I'm just hearing right now in the other room that it sounds like they just hit another three run homer so it may not be a good Sunday for Tennessee but they're like 30 something and 5 for the for the season I think so I think they can absorb a loss Yeah, very nice so far. Mm. 
a lot of growth there to remove also. And no issues. Oh, and they just hit another home run on Tennessee. Well, that's probably not good. All right, nice first pass. I'm going to go um, south to north and then do a clean up. Really nice. Pleasantly surprised. I just didn't know what to expect from it, you know, since obviously I've never used it. Um, but it's good stuff. I'm excited to see how the splash is now. I think it's a menthol um, and alcohol splash, I believe. I have to look at the ingredients. Mm. The other side of my back is starting to tighten up now. I've had to work from home since Monday. Had to put in earn time for one and a half days. It's the first day that I couldn't get out of bed. I had to call the doctor and go there. So went to the doctor and then came back home and worked from home for a little while. So kind of a kind of a stinky week. I hate not being there at the hospital. It's so much harder to do your job over the phone than it is to just, you know, walk into someone's room and talk to them. I mean all the other stuff, the charting and Screening and all that kind of stuff is fine to do from home, but actual interviewing is a lot easier in person. But anyway, we got it done. On to the next week. I'll go back tomorrow. Need to get in the shave. Look professional. Not that you can't look professional with a beard, but you know, it needs to be trimmed up. And uh, I was untrimmed totally. All right, get this water out of here. It got a lot of hair in it. I'm going to rest here for a second while this is happening starting to get tighter and tighter as we go you know kind of standing here in one spot but that's all right i can get back on the heating pad once i'm done it's tough getting old now really i've had um i've had lower back problems since my mid-20s so uh you know 25 years ago or so i was somebody i don't remember who it was but on um a video of mine the other day, I can't remember which video it was. Someone was like, you look, you know, a solid 30 years old. And I'm thinking, boy, my looks must be deceiving. Yeah, I'm, for those of you that don't know, I'm 50. I turned 50 last December. I think kind of all of my um, family, you know, brothers and my mother look quite young for our ages. So I guess that's pretty good genetics, skin-wise. Or the fact that we've all had oily skin. Except for my oldest brother didn't really have very oily skin. But anyway, here's my family history. Let me show you our family our family crest. Oh, wait. You know, I've got it right here. Hang on. Here's the Hay family crest. I know it was bad, wasn't it? Whatever. All right, let's just do some cleanup of the tough areas. Really nice soap. Really like the scent on it. 
was afraid it was going to be like a, you know, an oak mossy barbershop kind of thing, which I'm not a big fan of. Uh, but this, no, this is light. This is, you know, a little barbershop, a little soapy, uh, some citrus notes in there, a little herbal. Nice. Very nice. Nice job, Lucas Kruhoski. I hope that's close. Hope I'm doing a decent job of that. Get a little alum on my fingers. Now I'm just going to kind of feel my way around, see how we did. Really nice and light. Still held a nice amount of water, nice slickness. Nice scent. I mean, good job. Really not much to clean up here. Just kind of the usable, the usual suspects. Same places that always need just a little more attention. Very pleasantly surprised, especially at that price point say this is a very good value all right that's a great shave my back's tight but it's not not super bad yet so i think we're going to be able to finish here thank goodness i didn't want to have to cut it short especially as long as Lucas has been waiting for me to do this big dude barbers just call him big dude barbers Seems like a funny guy, too. All right, cold water rinse. Nice fresh feeling left on the face. Oh. Oh. Very nice shave. Nice to get that off of there. All right. <coughs> Alcohol, yep. Um, I don't see menthol. So glycerin, basically. Okay. Well, let's try it out. It's a cool looking little bottle. Mm. Mm. Nice, even fresher scent. Mm. I think I'm gonna use a little more of that. Nice and refreshing, good clean scent. Yeah, very nice. Mmm. Yeah, it feels super fresh. Good stuff, man. Good stuff, big dude Barbus. Doing a good job. And I'll go ahead and do my vitamin C. Wonder if I could just rub my face with an orange or lemon. The sea tetra is really good stuff. And I mean, you know, this is extra steps, but it doesn't take but you know, just another two or three minutes, so 
take care of your skin. You can grow new skin, but if the conditions aren't right, it's not going to be that great, great of skin. You need good skin texture as well. Um, and let's finish with Luther, 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 Luther. Daily hydrating gel moisturizer. And just get like that much, just probably too much, but whatever. Oh. Oh. Great shave, great post shave. Now we're getting ready to have a nice, clean, lemony scent on top of all that goodness. Oh, getting harder to bend down. <clears throat> That's tough, man. I mean, when you have back troubles, that, that takes over. You know, you can't do anything. It would just lock you up. My back muscles have been super tensed up in my lower back. Just can't seem to get them to let go. All right. John Varvatos, Artisan Pure, great scent. And I think you can get this whole bottle for around 40, around 40 bucks. Uh, if you look like Fragrance Net, um, check them out. So great shave to get today. Thank you guys for joining me and letting me whine to you about my back. Um, big dude Barbus, great job, really nice stuff. Um, still have some other new products to show you guys. So keep uh, a lookout for those. And then I've got a top secret one on the way from Moon Soaps. Um, top secret, but oh, I'm sorry, it's already here, but I've got the shave coming um, on the way. I just want to do it a little closer to the um, to the release date, which is May the 5th. So sometime this week, um, I will be getting that in. So hope you guys have a great week. Um, hope people are good to you. Hope you're good to people. Uh, be good people. And we'll see you on the next one. Peace.